Okay, having issues, it fires right up. Um, talked to Asus Tech yesterday and they said our O2 sensor wasn't really moving except for 13.5, 13.4. Thought it might be too close to the collector, so we moved it down pipe just a hair. It's about 10 inches away from the collector now. Um, everything's fine with that. Fuel pressure holds at about 45 to 48. Uh, steady. Um, we're getting fuel. This thing starts up and dies. It sounds like there's a vacuum leak, however, this thing only has four ports, three sixteenths in the back still plugged. I have one here still plugged and these two, one for the brake booster, one PCV. Um, but it sounds like when it fires up a large vacuum leak, it idles good, it's fine. And then it just cuts out and dies right away. I can hit the throttle and keep it alive for a few seconds, but it just dies instantly when I stop messing with it. Go ahead and cycle it and turn it on. Keeps doing that every single time. And if I don't touch it, cycle it off and turn it back on, watch how fast it goes. That was actually the longest it's run like that. Uh, we have the idle set in the computer for 850. Um, magnetic on the coil and the distributor. The distributor, I did lock the distributor out. Um, and it's controlling timing on the coil magnetic. So I think we've done everything we possibly can. I just don't know what the issue is now. Hopefully you can help.